Hi, I'm Ann Mazinga. And I'm Chris Walton. And this is Omnitalk Retail coming to you live from Cologne, Germany with one of the newest and coolest checkout free experiences in the world. You said it, Ann. I mean, can you believe this? We're in Cologne. We're out in front of the Reba Pick and Go store powered by Trigo, which is one of the coolest, like you said, coolest checkout free stores that is out there. And unfortunately, the one thing I will say, unfortunately, due to GDPR, we're not able to shoot inside the store like we typically would with our OmniTalk store tours. But Ann, I think we've come up with something better to just show yes. how fast and exciting this shopping experience is. It's so convenient and yes. it's so easy to use. And we're going to do something like a la supermarket sweeps, which I can't wait because I'm, I'm, I'm pumped to go and get my sweep on. Yes. Necessity is the mother of all invention, Chris. And we have come up with an excellent plan. You're going to live out your supermarket sweep dreams. I am. I'm going to send you in with a list. You're going to set that timer, and we're going to see how long it takes you to get all the items on that list. Yes. All yes. right. I, I'm going to give you the list. Are you ready? Of course I am. I was born ready, Ann. All right. So here's what I want you to get. All right. A cold bottle of water. Wait. Well, before I get started, do I need to write this down? No. It's three items. Okay, three, three items. Three items. Okay, good. All right. Bottle of water. Cold, cold bottle, bottle of water. water. Okay. You're very Please. specific, Ann. Yes. On your list. Okay. Not room temp. Okay. Cold bottle of water. All right. A pack of gum. A pack of gum. And... We are in Germany, so I would like you to get me a pretzel from the bakery case. Fair, fair, fair enough. That makes sense. That makes sense. I would also like to get myself something. Is that okay? Mm, I mean, I suppose. What do you want? I'm going to, believe it or not, I'm going to get myself a beer because I've been in Germany, I've been in Europe now with you for uh. seven days, and I think, you know, I think I deserve fair, it. I think fair. I deserve you it. You definitely deserve that beer. Okay. Should set I start the, the clock? Let's start the clock. All right. Here we go. On your mark. Clock is started. Get set. Go. I'm out. Uh, wait, one more thing, actually. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, can you get me a latte also, please? Okay. So while Chris is in the store, I want to tell you guys a little bit about this uh, this shop right behind us. So Reva Group is the second largest grocer in Germany. And this is their first computer vision AI store. As Chris mentioned, it's powered by Trigo. Now, what's unique about this store is that there are a few ways that you can shop the store. It's a hybrid store. That means people can just walk in go pick things up off the shelf and have a traditional shopping experience, have a wait in a queue, check out with a cashier. Now they also have the option of doing self checkout in this store. So they can go pick their items up, you know, scan them themselves, put them in the bag and walk out. But what I'm having Chris do today is actually the fully checkout free experience. Now, Chris had to download an app for the Reva pick and go store. Super simple, entered in his name, credit card information and he was good to go it took less than two minutes to do he then gets a qr code which he'll use to enter the store so just like getting on an airplane he scans the qr code goes through the turnstile and he can pick up those items that i put on my shopping list for him now the other re thing that's important to point out the reason that i sent him on the lookout for those specific items is because those are typically challenging items for computer vision cameras to identify we have a pack of gum which is a very small item with small writing and small packaging we have a pretzel from a bakery case that you know is typically been challenging for the computer to recognize we also have the coffee i added a self-dispensing beverage so the, the cameras have to identify that Chris is the one that's dispensing the beverage without any packaging on it um, and that that is tied to him as a shopper. And then finally, we have Chris getting some beer, which is actually a great thing that he added on because that will typically require age verification in a store like this. So as you see, this is in a very busy shopping district. People are on their way to work, to school, and it's a very fast way for them, whether they're using one of the other options or the checkout free option, to get what they need on their way to work, to school, what have you. Now, the other things about the store, yesterday Chris and I went in, we checked the store out. There were still people that were waiting in line. So part of this experience is a little bit like, you know, when you first use the Amazon, go, or sorry, the Starbucks mobile pickup, I was just tell, talking about Starbucks mobile pickup. Oh, yeah. It's, yeah. It felt like that, actually. felt like walking in Did there. Did it really? Yeah, yeah, no, it was crazy. But but first, Anne, I want to give you your latte. Oh. I got you a latte macchiato. You didn't specify the type of latte. Mm, so I went, that's I, my I, bad. I gave you a little That's bit my extra. bad. All right, let's see how long it took, Anne. 
Three minutes. Three minutes. That's how long it took me to do that. Was the la- did the latte macchiato set you back a little bit? It did it. It took. Yeah, it did. It took me. It, took, it was like waiting for it. But yeah, that was it's my the, fault. I'm so bougie. Like the, whole, the longest part of the whole process. Everything else was super simple. So I'll show you what I got. I got you your as asked for cold bottle of water. Very important. Cold bottle of water. Okay. What else? I got you your. Airwaves menthol eucalyptus gum because I know how big of an Airwaves fan you are. Only Airwaves. <laughs> right? <laughs> I got you the PS de Resistance, the pretzel bread. It's a beautiful piece of bread, yeah. Chris. Beautiful piece of bread. And then, Ann, just to show you the type of guy I am, I got not only myself a beer, but I also got you a beer uh, as well. I so hope you'll share this with me later. So thoughtful. Um, well, Chris, I have to say, you know, that was pretty fast. You got all of those items. Three minutes or less. Um, Anything else that people should know about the experience that, you know, while you were in there that you'd call out? No, I mean, overall, it was super easy. I had like zero complaints whatsoever. And, you know, I'm a pretty big retail nerd. Like the app was easy to download. I scanned it to get in the store. The doors opened. And, you know, the longest thing was just waiting for the coffee to be made. That was probably like half of my time in there. And then I just grabbed everything off the shelf, opened the cases for the bread, opened the cases for the refrigeration. You know, which is not an easy thing to do in these systems and got the gum and just the doors parted like the Red Sea. And I walk out of the store and there I was. I'm done. I'm here back with you. It was great. Chris, were there people waiting in line there? Like, I mean, we mentioned the Starbucks experience, but was there were people waiting in line? Like, do you do you feel like you're kind of the ninja, the retail ninja? Oh, that's totally. Going- it, I totally felt like a boss. Yeah. You said you were talking about Starbucks. That's yeah. exactly how I felt when I walked in. It was like the first time I used Starbucks order pickup. You know, you walk in and there's people still using the self checkout machine. There's still people standing in line. The security. Actually, I winked at the security guard. I'm like, yeah, dude, I know what I'm doing. God, of course. And he's he like, he like gave me the thumbs up. It was great. But here's the other thing. I've already got my receipt and. This is pretty crazy. So if you will come in here, like come in tight on this, we've got the uh, the water, the bread, the gum, the latte macchiato, and then also uh, we've got the uh, the recycling charge that they charge here in Germany as well for uh, the two beers and the bottle of water. So. All told, a pretty awesome experience. Uh, no complaints whatsoever. And then there's there's uh, the beers at the top as well. So, yeah, so 100% accuracy. Pretty impressive. I've already got my receipt here. And let's see, I think I kept the, stock, the clock running here to give you guys an idea. So, yeah, so like basically 545 right now on the clock for this whole experience from start to receipt finish, you know, pretty quick. That's a great way for people in this in this busy shopping and working district to get in and out, get what they need and not have to wait in line. So there you have it. Uh, Omnitalk Retail, live from Cologne, Germany, at the Reva Pick and Go store, showing you what the future of shopping looks like.